Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm going to do my saggies. I'm going to do my little hot tamales. I'm going to do next two weeks, okay, first half of December. Um, what I'm going to do is initially I'm going to do my hot tamales up here, <laughs> okay, and then I'm going to do outside influences, um, outside energy, but you have to remember this is a general and it's for thousands, okay, so it can go either way. You could actually be here. You know, it really just depends which energy is stronger. But, oh, son of a bitch. What are you guys, in a sticky situation? Complicated? Complicated and understatement? What is going on with my saggies? Saggy, saggies. Having a pence. What are you going to invest your time in? A relationship? Someone's got new feeling. Okay? But uh, not, not talking about them. So, I don't know if this is anxiety, lack of sleep. It looks like to me somebody wants a second chance. So... little lack of strength right now I wouldn't even say confidence okay I think you're just overcoming something um you know to me you have an important decision to make on what you're going to invest your time in right now because with this particular I'm using this deck for many reasons but this particular deck with the seven of pence okay this is you know somebody has that pent somebody also knows that something didn't work out before and do we want to invest our time in a situation that we've foreseen, okay, or has already happened or your gut's already telling you, you know, okay, but this is what this is, you know, somebody's going to come in and offer love or you're about to offer love, but you just don't know if it's the right decision, do you make the first step? Do you make the offer? Because you have the eight of wands here and it's reversed. Okay. So to me, this is no communication and no one's moving forward right now. This is a feeling. It's a thought. What am I going to do? Um, to me, it looks like you definitely want a second chance with somebody. The queen of wands, you know, um, or it can be the king. It doesn't matter gender. It's, it's, it's the fact that whomever this is right now, is, is frustrated too, okay, um, not using their intuition either, so tell me about judgment, if you haven't been sleeping, you will, okay, um, so somebody self-sabotaged a situation in the past, clear as day, so I don't know if you're dealing with a Cappy, you might want to check out Cappy's energy, because they had a, uh, predicament like this with the two sevens but here somebody's not using their intuition which is strange which makes me think it might be the opposite energy but I'm not positive to me it's just you might not want to put any effort into it you're not paying attention to the situation a lot of my queens and kings reverses there's so many meanings but like when they're reversed to me it's you know, you're either nasty or not putting the, the energy in, blatantly ignoring a situation. This could be you self-sabotaging a situation because it's like you want a second chance with somebody. But you might be self-sabotaging your own situation right now, especially if you have feelings for somebody. And it probably has to do with your past, whether it's the, a past person or just your past in general. So let's see what the external energy is. Okay. So external to you, or remember what I said, it can go either way, but this is somebody who's, you know, this is communication to me. This is straight talk, no bullshit, especially next to the high priestess. This is this is somebody who's ready to, to listen and have something solid. Okay. To me, somebody's thinking about, you know, their their foundation and, and where do they want to go with this 
with whatever this is. Um, I don't know if it's a same sex scenario, okay? But you have the Ten of Pence here reversed, okay? Because I think you were already, I think this is somebody you already know that you want a second chance with, okay? Because you're dealing with somebody who's feisty who doesn't want to put in time and work right now. They're not looking, this person is, is not looking for a solid foundation, which is very contradicting energy. So this could be you having that conversation about what happened previously when it came to like you guys' home situation, if you guys live together or just your situationship in general, okay? This person's using their intuition though, so I don't know if there's hidden secrets. I don't feel like there is. I just think they're pretty intuitive. Yeah, it's definitely a spiritual person on my board here. Um, definitely same sex scenario here too. But again, it can be any gender. But the same sex is pretty prominent. Um, or this person's energy, I mean, they're just not solid right now, okay? They're just a lot of conflict in their life. They're, they're off-centered. They're not balanced. They're not grounded, all right? They have the seven of wands, and it, they're just tired of fighting. They always feel like they have to stand their ground, and they, they don't want to be bothered with the fight. So the person you're dealing with, their energy is um, very iffy right now. It, it goes from, like, this is like kind of bipolar energy because they want solid, but I don't think they are solid. Tell me about the high priestess. So the high priestess right now is, you know, lack of passion, tired of shit, and sad as shit, and not, and not grounded, and has quite the regrets right now. I really feel like some of you got clarity and then others of you have not. Um, let me find out about this page of cups for you real quick. All right, the Queen of Swords, and it's reversed. So this is, I wouldn't reach out and communicate right now if that's the plan, because the Queen of Swords reverse is a biatch, okay? Something went down. But again, somebody wants a second chance. To me, it's almost like, well, nah, shit went down. But I kind of feel like you guys might be self-sabotaging a situation. For some, some of my gummies are self-sabotaging their own situations. I think you think someone's deceiving you. But with these two together, I think they were telling you the truth. There's a good possibility for some. The truth was being told. But right now, this energy, very ungrounded, sad, and tired. So, the bottom of the deck was the Ace of Cups, though. All right, this, here's another 10. Somebody is just, somebody's not, and it's reversed, all right? It, it's something that ended that, you know, looks like it might come back around, but somebody's not processing something. To me, that's not, to me, that's not self-love. That's, there's, there's love here somewhere, okay? So I'm going to use this deck for shits and giggles okay, for any messages that maybe I, I didn't, that maybe I didn't get out there. Um, I just want to clarify this for four ones. And it's exactly sideways. So hold on, tell me about the eight. Because this is something that somebody would put energy into, but it's sideways, so it's still up in the air. All right, we got the devil, something coming out of to toxicity. Okay, something... Or you're dealing with a cappy and you can't be bothered, okay? But with the Seven of Cups here, it's 
I, I feel like there was there was something, but like I think you think they did something shady, but I don't I don't see it. I think you think they're lying. You guys might be self sabotaging your own situation, possibly. Okay. Um find out about the seven of cups because this is karma this is to me it's karma it's the king of pence but it's reversed I'm not putting the energy into it but I think for some some of you just think that I'm telling you something died though something's dead like something definitely ended but I think somebody wants to have a reconciliation, a reunion, a second chance. And I think you think somebody's lying. Like there's a huge trust issue. But I don't I don't see the lies like that. I see this person holding on to you and very unstable right now. But because of loss, because of how they emotional loss, you know? Additional messages for my gummy bears. I mean my saggies. Ooh, some of you might be dealing with a gummy bear. See? Love. Get some, give some. It would cheer your ass up. I'm telling you, I knew there was something here. I hope you're not, I hope you don't self-sabotage your situation, okay? So it says, it's dark and you can't see a fucking thing. Get out of your head. Get your head out of your ass. Pronto. Somebody, it looks like somebody is about to self-sabotage a situation and there's love here, okay? So, I wish you the best. I love you guys. Bye.